Ever wondered how to make restaurant-style butter chicken at home? A dish so divine it's almost a cuisine on its own, butter chicken is probably one of the most popular Indian recipes, loved by all. Today we're going to unravel the secrets behind this beloved dish and bring it right into your kitchen. First things first, gather the ingredients. For the chicken, you'll need 300 grams of boneless chicken breast, one tablespoon each of ginger and garlic paste, one tablespoon of red chili powder and salt to taste. You'll also need some oil to pan fry the chicken. For the gravy, you'll need 500 grams of roughly slit tomatoes, 100 grams of roughly cut onions, one tablespoon of garlic paste, 50 grams of cashew nuts, and one teaspoon of kasuri methi. You'll also need half a teaspoon of garam masala, four tablespoons of sugar, two tablespoons of cashmere chili powder, five tablespoons of butter, three tablespoons of cream, two tablespoons of malt vinegar, or one and a half tablespoons of white vinegar, and salt to taste. Now let's dive into the process. Start by marinating the chicken with the ginger paste, garlic paste, red chili powder, and salt. Let it sit for 15 to 20 minutes. Next, heat some oil in a pan and fry the marinated chicken pieces until they're cooked. Once done, set them aside in a bowl. In the same pan, add the onions, a spoonful of butter, and a touch of oil. Once the onions are cooked, add in the tomatoes and cashew nuts. Now throw in some water, the garlic paste, salt, malt vinegar, sugar, garam, masala powder, and chili powder. Mix it all together and let it simmer for 15 to 20 minutes. Then churn the mixture into a fine puree. Strain it back into the pan, making sure there's a minimal wastage. Now add the butter, cream, chicken, and kasuri methi. Let it simmer for an additional 5 to 7 minutes. Finally, garnish the dish with a dollop of cream and a sprinkle of kasuri methi. And there you have it. The divine restaurant-style butter chicken ready to be savored right in the comfort of your home. This recipe serves 4 to 5 people, perfect for a family meal or a small gathering. So, the next time you crave this Indian delicacy, you know exactly how to whip it up.